Hello dear students, Assalamu alaikum, I am your maths teacher, so today we will study from New Slabus Mathematics Day 1, 7th edition. So we are on exercise 8a and we have done question number, up to question number 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 we will solve today. So 11 question is, the maximum number of marks attainable at mathematics competition is 60, so total marks are uh, 60 and there is a competition. Kate obtains 40 marks out of 60. Priya obtains 46 marks out of 60. And Nora obtains 49 marks out of 60. The examination board decides that, that those who score 80 percent and above will get gold award. Those who score 70 percent and to 79 percent inclusive uh, will get silver award and those who score 60 percent to 69 percent inclusive uh, will get bronze award. Determine the type of award each girl get. So the question is given that uh, total marks are 60 and there are three girls Kate, Nora and Priya. right? So Kate got 40 out of 60, so we calculate the percentage, uh, 40 over 60 multiply 100 and by, can, uh, by simplifying we get 66.6%. Uh, then Nora got six, 49 over 60 multiply 60, we simplify this and we get, she gets 81.66%. Uh, Priya got 46 marks out of 60 and the percentage she got 76 percent right so now uh, which medal or award the uh, the girls will get uh, 81 percent is the highest percentage so she will get gold medal or gold uh, <coughs> award right and second one is uh, Priya she got 46 out of 60 and she will she has got, uh, scored 76.6 uh, percent so she will get silver medal or award. Then third one Kate got 66.6% uh, .6 and she will get bronze medal or award. Then question number 12. Okay. So uh, the company uh, of 12,000 employees in the uh, she, uh, that due to the financial recession so there is a change in the uh, financial uh, setup so some of the uh, employees have been retrenched. Uh, 50.75% of them had to pay cut, reduced salaries. So the rest were uh, unaffected. So or the rest of the staff, they were not affected by the changes. So find the number of the employees who were unaffected by the financial. So question number 12 here, the company employees are 12,000, right? Then uh, retrenched employees, so those were 2.5 percent, so 2.5 over 100, we will calculate the percentage uh, and the number of employees those who were retrenched. So 2.5 percent over 100 multiplied uh, 12,000, so 2.5, so over 100 we have cut. Uh, here you can see in this step 2.5 over 100 multiplied 12,000 so we have cancelled the zeros so it is uh, 2.5 <coughs> uh, we have uh, this removed the decimal here so 25 over 10 we can write and here 120 is left so by multiplying 25 by 12 we get 300 employees were retrenched then uh, the salaries were reduced or salaries were cut uh, those employees were 50.75 percent. So by simplifying all this, so those employees were 6,090 employees. Those uh, were affected by the salaries. So the total affected employees are 6,000 and here we have calculated uh, 300 employees and then here uh, 6,000. So we add them and total affected employees are 6390, right? So these are affected employees. Unaffected employees we have to see 
uh, we will subtract from the total employees 12,000 minus 6390 and we get 561, 5610 employees are unaffected. Right? Then question number 13. Uh, Athens monthly in salary is $1,850, $1,850 in particular month. Right? He spent 20.5% of his salary on room rent. Right? He pays rent. So, $690 on food and 940 on other expenses. Express the amount that uh, he overspent as percentage of his monthly salary, giving your answer in uh, correct up to two decimal places. Right. So here, uh, monthly salary of Athens is uh, eighteen uh, hundred dollars, eighteen hundred and fifty dollars. Rent he paid twenty point five percent. Then we simplify this. And he we get three seventy nine point two five dollars rent paid, right? Then this is uh, the amount he paid for rent. So overspent uh, budget was salary that uh, six ninety plus nine forty. It is already given in the statement uh, the question. So we add them and we subtract uh, the actual salary from this overspent budget. So this is. Uh, 2009.25 minus 1850 is the salary total salary right so we have left uh, the over budget is 159.25 so this is the extra money he has spent so now if we calculate the percentage here right 159.25 over 185 multiplied by 100 so here I have calculated and we get 86.0810 right then question number 14, there are 600 pages in a novel, Rui Peng reads 150 uh, pages of the novel on Friday. So uh, there are 600 pages of novel, 150 pages were read on Friday and 40% of the remaining pages on Sunday. Then she again read the novel 40% uh, of the pages, uh, total pages. right? So, express the number of pages that remains to be read. Uh, we have to find out the rem uh, remaining pages to be read, uh, the percentage of the total number also. Right. So, here total pages were 600 of the novel, pages read on Friday 150 and rem uh, pages uh, remaining after reading 150, 600 minus 150 is equal to 450, 450 pa pages were remaining. Then she again read some 40 percent pages on uh, Sunday, right? And then we, if we calculate 100 minus 40 is equal to 60 percent uh, pages were left. So here uh, we calculate by 60 uh, percent, 60 over 100 multiplied 450, is equal to 270 pages were uh, left, right? Then if we see that how many pages were read, uh, 40 over 100 and this 180 pages were read uh, when she said that 40% uh, of the pages she read. So this is, uh, you can calculate, uh, if 60, these are the left pages, right? These are left and these were the read pages on Sunday. So we cal uh, four, we uh, subtract this 450 minus 270, 180 are left here. Uh, this is uh, when 60% pages were left. This is when 40% pages were read, right? So both ways are correct. You can uh, solve anyway. Then we have to calculate the percentage by uh, I have found, I have uh, done by 270 percentage of remaining pages 270 over 600 multiplied 100. So 45 5% pages were uh, left. Thank you very much.